And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Sports Re... And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Sports History Dork. I am your host, as always, Matt McLaughlin, from my lovely estate in the Hamptons, as you can see behind me. I am back this week, and this week I'm going to be talking about perhaps the most one-sided rivalry in all of college football. It's Penn State versus Maryland. The Nittany Lions versus the Terrapins, which what the f*** is a Terrapin? I root for Georgetown Hoyas and the Penn State Nittany Lions, and even I don't know what a Terrapin is. If we're just talking, picking this game off mascots, I'd pick Nittany Lion every time. Who the f*** is picking a Terrapin? Who's picking a team that plays in the shell? Real, real creative name for you guys there. But what, what's the backstory of this rivalry? These teams have played over 40 games between each other. Penn State leads the series 40 to 3 to 1. Yes, 40 to 3 to 1. What? <laughs> and I know Maryland fans are going to be trying to talk that shit. They're going to be trying to talk in trash and all of that. But just shut up. Just shut up. You won in 2020. Congratulations. Before that, you won in the early 2000s. Congratulations. You won in the 60s. The, la the win, the only win that Maryland had in this series before the year 2000 was in 1961. Martin Luther King was still walking down the streets and protesting the last time Maryland beat Penn State in a football game. All right, Penn State won 24 straight games at that point from the 60s to the 90s, no contest. There's virtually no contest. So this game doesn't change anything. And between the two programs, sure, Maryland has 11 conference championships of Penn State's four. That's impressive. But the Natties, the Natties is what matter. Two national championships for the Penn State Nittany Lions, only one for the Maryland Terrapins. You want to talk about first round draft picks? Penn State is has produced 39 first round draft picks in the NHL draft. How much has Maryland produced? Oh, that's right. Yeah, the, the, the very large number of 13 compared to Penn State. Step up on our level. You are not on our level. Penn State will always thrash Maryland. Penn State will thrash Maryland this weekend, and you can take that for data. 